Good morning, everybody. Well, actually, when you're watching this video, it could be evening. I'm still going to leave it, though. Welcome to everybody who came to Dublin. My name is Coach Nick. We're here to talk today about what slash when slash how slash why do I eat during the day? Well, how you eat is <laughs> you put food in your mouth and you chew it. Why you eat is because if you don't eat, you'll die. But let's talk about the what and when. So I guess we don't really need these. That was just filler. So, what slash when do we eat during the day? So, let's make a little chart. Now let's say you wake up at 6 a.m. and you go to bed at 10 p.m. Let's be realistic, 10, 49 p.m. Now, if you're up this long, you want to be eating minimum six times a day. And depending on your weight loss goal, uh, let's say you're 200 pounds, you're going to want to eat, want to? You're going to want to eat about 75% of your weight. So if you are 200 pounds, you're going to want to aim for about 1,500 calories. You know, or around there, give or take. When you start going less than 1,000, though, that's just way too few. Um, but that's for another time. So, you want to eat within an hour of when you wake up. So by 7 a.m., you want to have eaten food. And then maybe the next three hours, you want to eat again. And then, let's say about 1 p.m. And then, let's say 3 p.m., you have a little snack. <clears throat> about 6 p.m., you have another snack. And then 7.30 p.m., you have dinner. Um, I know they say don't eat past 7, but if you have these two snacks after lunch, by the time dinner comes, you're not going to be as hungry, and you're going to be less likely to gorge yourself on food because you've been starving since lunch. If you don't have these two snacks, you're going to be very hungry. What most people do is while they make dinner, they eat a large portion of the dinner they're making, and then they have second dinner. So we don't want to have first and second dinner. We just want to have a small dinner. And I want you to think of these meals as snacks and not meals. See, I'm crossing out meals. Now, what you should eat looks a little like this. As your day starts, you want carbohydrates. You want good carbs like oatmeal. You can have a piece of whole wheat toast, not my favorite. And then for lunch, you could have some brown rice. I'd say until about lunch, you're totally allowed to have thick carbohydrates. As your day goes on, though, vegetables need to become a massive priority. No one's ever argued with me that vegetables are not good for you. <laughs> so I'm just going to leave those there. And we all know vegetables are good for you. The more green and leafy they are, the better. And last but not least, protein. Your body needs protein throughout the day. Protein heals broken muscle fibers. Uh, you need protein, especially if you're working out. And I know that if you're watching your, this video, you're thinking about it and starting. So make sure you're getting protein in your diet. People always then ask, well, where do fruits go? Fruits are fine, but vegetables are better. You can have fruits, but I'd much rather you have vegetables. You know, fruits in the morning, get your day started around. Maybe a, you know, your snack here, that's fine. But as your day continues, vegetables are the way to go. Nicholas Frank, Fit Body Bootcamp Dublin. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Have a wonderful day.